Welcome to our Waltz Tried Polka Lesson number one. This will be the session for the follows. So I'm using my right foot. Did you get on your best polka dot outfit like I did? See my dress? Polka dots. All right. And even the socks. Polka dot socks. Yes. Celebrate our polka culture starting in the, ninth, the 30s. The 1830s. Bohemia is what gave us polka dancing. The greatest dance that followed the waltz took over the world, lit the world on fire with partner dancing. Because it is a faster pace than waltz and uh, it's got the little hop in it, so that's so fun. You're gonna learn to twirl your partner around. Usually it dances, this is gonna be the one, the fastest, most exhilarating dance. Everybody just collapses in chairs afterwards. Um, but you can take it slower if you want. We're gonna break it down nice and slow. Follow part. Let's start with uh, the rhythm of polka dance, which is in eight counts. So clap with me, starting with your right foot on one. One and two and three and four. Five and six and seven and eight. One and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight. All right, so getting that starting to warm up here. Now we're gonna do the and, so I'll go even slower, but we're gonna be stepping on the and count. One and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and. So again, follow me, right foot. One and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and. Nice. The basic polka step, let's practice the gallop. When you were a kid, you did galloping like a horse, which is one foot in front. So let's do that as the follow, a gallop, starting with your right foot. Gallop and gallop and gallop and one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and now let's do that with your left foot because we will be changing feet. One and two and three four and five and six and seven and eight and if you are more in shape, athletic, feel free to actually gallop. One, two, two, and five, six, and seven, and eight, and left foot. One, and two, and three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and. Great. Now, we're going to put that into the basic step, starting with the right foot for the follow, one and two, and then the next and, you can do a hop or you can just pause. And, three and four with the left foot, and, five and six and seven and eight and, one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and. We're just going side to side, the basic step to the side, one step on each count. So it's step, together, step. Let me do it with the pause now, if you prefer that style. So this is a pause, step, together, step, pause, step, together, step, pause, step, together, step, pause. One and two, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, seven, and eight, and. You may notice I'm starting to lean towards the direction I'm going. That would be my, the first foot. That helps you in polka. It helps you with momentum. So if you're doing everything in polka very upright, you don't have as much momentum as when you're swinging your body. And three and four. So lean from the waist, even from the hips, towards your foot, that you're, the direction you're traveling. 
it makes it feel more fun too. So again, starting with your right foot, side basic, one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and music. Let's do some nice, slow. Right foot ready and two, three and four, five, six, seven and eight and one and two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight, one and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight, one. If you have a partner, you can face each other. I have a wonderful lead partner, Herbert. You can face each other, hold your hold double hands, give each other lots of space, and just go side to side with this. So that will start to make it even more fun. That is what it's all about. A little bit faster. Lead with the left, follow with the right, here we go. a turning spot turn we're going to do it very slow so I'm facing front I'm going to be turning to my right side hold your right hand out like you're hitchhiking I'm doing the follow roll so I'm starting with my right foot now that means the, the lead okay I need you again the lead is facing me we're both turning this direction one and two I've done a quarter turn on the first two counts, uh, and I'm going to continue turning the same direction. Three and four, 
five and six, seven and eight. I've done one complete turn the same direction with a quarter turn each of the two counts. So starting, and it helps to lean towards that foot. One and two, now lean towards your left foot. Three and four, I've done a half a turn. Five and six, seven and eight. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. We've done one whole turn in the eight counts. <clears throat> so I'm facing that wall. I face the next wall, the next wall. Ready? One and two, three and four, five and six. Back home again. And one and two, three and four, five and six. Back home again. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. Do it to some slower music. spotting turns or you can look at your partner and then you're not looking at the room whirling around that will make you easier so let's see Herbert take a well-deserved break he does a great job we have two moves now we have the side basic go side to side we have the right spot turn let's put those both together one set of eight side basic, one set of eight, the right spot turn. We'll alternate. Sound good? My arm's getting tired from carrying her, but he's a little heftier. It's all his muscles. Same speed, just eight counts side basic, eight counts of right spot turn, and alternating. I think it's slightly faster. 63%. I did the whole thing with the left foot, so that was the lead roll. Now I'll do it with the right foot as the follow. Get a little mixed up sometimes. Right. So the right foot as the follow. Here we go. One and two.
So we're going to do it faster. Faster, up to more polka speed. Let's do this about 80%. This is 80% polka speed. Same thing. Here we go. going to start traveling around the room because that's what polka is about. <clears throat> going forward as the follow, my right foot, the lead is on my left side um, and we're just going to use the same footwork traveling forward. So right together, right, hop, left together, left, hop, right together, right, hop, left, one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and one and two three and four and five and six seven and eight <clears throat> Left together, 
So that would be side to side with your partner, both traveling forward. No danger of stepping on each other's feet because you're not stepping into each other's territory. <clears throat> but let's make it a little more interesting. We are going to add a, the patty cake. Right. Leaves on the left side, follow on the right side. We're traveling counterclockwise around the room. <clears throat> We're going to start off facing towards each other. So I'm starting with my right foot, the right together, right. I'm going to angle my body diagonally, kind of leaning towards my forward foot. And as I do that, I'm facing my partner a little more. It's not face to face this way, it's just like we're making a V, 90 degree angle. So it's an eighth of a turn toward my partner. If we're side to side here, like a flat line, we're just turning, we're making a 90 degree angle here. So towards the partner, but we can patty cake. Give me your hand, Herbert. Patty cake, the hand on the first three parts. And to do that, I turn my whole body. I don't twist, I'm just turning my side forward. And he's turning his side forward at an angle, diagonally. So it's right together, right. We patty caked here. Now we turn away from each other. Left together, left. I'm just turning not all the way back, just part of the way. Eighth of, a, eighth of an angle. And then we, when we do it again, so that would be left together, left, three and four. Five and six, we're towards each other, we patty cake again. Five and six, and away from each other, seven and eight. One and two is the patty cake. Away is three and four, patty cake. From the beginning, patty cake. One and two, away, three and four, patty cake. Five and six, away. Seven and eight, patty cake. One and two, away. Three and four, patty cake. Five and six, away. Seven and eight. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. One and two, three and four, five and Six, seven, and eight. Music. Here we go. marching on and polka is bouncing on. We've got the patty cake away. Let's do that a little faster. My arm is getting tired. Herbert, you take another lovely rest. Good job, good job. A little faster. So remember, starts with patty cake and then away. Here we go. to our choreography, starting with side basic. 
One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. Right spot turn. One and two, three and four, five, seven and eight. Patty cake. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. Excellent. Now we've got part number four, the traveling right turn. Similar to traveling forward and the right spot turn. Put those together and you've got it. We have ended with the patty cake. So the patty cake started with patty cake, one and two, away, three and four, patty cake, five and six, away, seven and eight. Now you go back into a patty cake. That starts to turn. That starts the turn. So demonstrate with Herbert. This one makes more sense with a partner. So we've done our patty cakes. Patty cake, away. Patty cake, away. We're traveling forward. Now we naturally come back to the patty cake again. Patty cake, only this time we hold on and we start the traveling right turn. It looks like this. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. We have turned a half turn with each two counts. The previous one we did a quarter turn, so this one we're traveling, we're turning twice as much, twice as fast. So it looks like one and two. So he is traveling around me. We're both going to the right. One and two. On two, he has tr traded places with me. Now our elbows are pointing forward. And this is where I travel across. Three and four, hop. Now we're back where we started. The lead is on the inside track. I'm on the outside track. We've done a whole circle. Three, six, turning to the right. Now I'll break it down a little more slowly. Back from the beginning. The feet rhythm are the same. We're just turning our whole body in a gradual circle. Some people think you travel forward. One and two, and then you hop away the round, all the way around. You won't make it. You have to start the turn on the one. It's a gradual turn. One and two, and a hop, you finish getting all the way around. On the three and the four, I do what the lead just did. Three and four, hop. So in those two full counts, that's four half counts, I've done a half a turn. The hardest part is the person who's traveling, that's my line of dance, that's the direction. The person who's crossing that with their back to the front. In the first part, it's the lead, that's the hardest part. So I have to help him get across. We getting across. Now I'm on the inside. I'm going to be turning my back to the front, flipping across. He has to help me get across. Let's see, that was one and two for Herbert. Three and four for me. Now we're back to the beginning again. He's going to cross over on five and six. Five and six, hop. Now I'm crossing over seven and eight. Seven and eight, hop. So the person crossing over has to get ahead of the other partner. That's the tricky part. If you're both well connected, that makes it easier. And you're actually helping swing that partner across. Let's try that again. Do it slow motion here with your partner. One and two, hop. Three and four, hop. Five and six, hop. Seven and eight, hop. One and two, hop. Three and four, hop. Five and six, hop. Seven and eight, hop. I'll do it a little bit faster. One and two, hop. Three and four, hop. Five. Six, hop, seven and eight, hop, one and two, hop, three and four, hop, five and six, hop, seven and eight, hop. One of the secrets.
secret is you get a head start on the turn. So as we're starting, her verse of lead, he's getting the head start. He's starting to go across me right on the one. One and two, hop. Now I'm starting the turn on the three and four. Three and four, hop. That way there's plenty of time. Let's try that too, some music. Slowing it down. Here we go. dizzy maybe but your feet keeping your feet going is the secret another secret as I've mentioned and we're gonna do it a little faster is to lean forward lean the forward direction that helps you get around one and two now I have to switch to the other side three and four now I'm leaning the forward direction five and six seven and eight then your whole body that way it helps you get your partner around and it helps you go forward and it just feels more fun so a little faster this is up to let's do 90 yeah that was 91 90 okay everybody here we go We're gonna help that. Uh, let's put those all together. Less dizzy. It's the constant turning that kind of does you in. So eight counts of each part. We have four parts. Part one, side to side. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. Part two, right spot turn. One and two, and four, five and six, seven and eight. Part three. Patty cake. One and two, three and four, five and six, seven and eight. Part four, right travel. 
traveling turn. One and two, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight. Begin again, right side basic. Side basic. I'll call it out. Let's keep this fast speed, I like it. Side basic. session number two and keep practicing this it takes a while to get it in if you needed some aerobic exercise this is it again the different styles of polka on the East Coast according to Molly B who does a weekly online two-hour polka party you'll have to find that Molly B Letter B. She's traveled around the country. East Coast, their style is faster. Cleveland, Ohio, they slide their feet. They don't do the hop. They keep their feet on the floor. Pennsylvania, it's a slower tempo, but more notes, so they, it sounds livelier. Uh, Wisconsin, faster speed. They get absolutely wild, she said, crazy, leaping around the room. I gotta go to Wisconsin. Nebraska, it's slower marching. Good for you, Nebraska. Keep marching to your own rhythm. And California, she did not know what they do in California. I don't know. So Molly, come on out and tell us and see what we do in California. And let's show her that we can poke it too. Here's a famous country western musician. See if you can guess who it is. Quote, my first job, let's see if I can say their accent, my first job was in a bohemian polka band, the Ray Jack family polka band in Abbott. The old man in the band had another blacksmith shop in Abbott, but he liked me. All he had was horns and drums, and I was set up over there with my little guitar, with no amps or nothing. I would play as loud as I wanted to, and nobody could hear me. Willie Nelson. Thank you for joining our Waltz Tribe polka lesson number one. 
Hope you enjoyed it. Have a fabulous polka week. Dance with you next time. Big thanks to my partners, Herbert the Broom, Gloria the Mop, and Molly B, who does her two-hour polka party online. Look her up on Molly B and the Squeeze Box Polka Band with her husband. They have fabulous polka culture going there. Polka Hall of Fame, here we come. So thanks for joining. Have a great polka week and hope we will dance with you soon. Thank you guys for dancing with me. I really appreciate it. Hope you had a fun time. Did you have a fun time? Yes, they did. Yes, they did. And your partners, your partners will have a fun time too. A famous country western musician, very famous, said that polka was how he got his start. My first job was in a bohemian polka band, the Red, Red Sheck family polka band in Abbott. The old man in the band had another blacksmith shop in Abbott, but he liked me. All he had was horns and drums, and I was set up over there with my little guitar. No amps or nothing. I could play as loud as I wanted to, and nobody could hear me. Can you guess who that is? Mr. Willie Nelson. Willie Nelson saying how Polka launched his music career. Thanks for Polka dancing with me. Hope you have a wonderful dance week. Keep practicing and we will dance again with you soon.